Today is October 1920s to 1930s. I'm Mom Nabas. And I'm Ravni Tudu. And you're watching The Famous Four Show. Well, the shops are empty, bells are jingling, and it's that not-so-pleasant time of year when Canadians from all walks of life prepare to experience the not-so-miracle plague of locusts. These are species that can breed rapidly under suitable conditions and subsequently become gregarious and migratory when their populations become dense enough. Say Unfortunately, what? besides the fact that dust bowls are left behind, locusts are known to produce toxins that render them inedible and may cause a severe skin reaction in sunlight. This is why God invented long johns. Life sucks. Get a toque. Embrace your Canadianness. I mean, we are the true note strong and free. So, in other onions, Mian was just voted back into Parliament as Prime Minister, but apparently we just can't get enough of King. I mean, the guy's always peeking around the corner, waiting to come back. Mian only lasted three days before King demolished him with his majority liberal government. I mean, really, Mian? That's shorter than Kim Kardashian and Chris's marriage. In other news, take a look at these pictures. This is a picture of sophisticated, get your relief vultures on Bennett. This is the wild party animal Bennett. The difference is impeccable. And we'll be right back after this commercial message. Are you tired of using your vacuum to dry your hair? Does your hair always get caught and just never want to come out? Well, no need to worry. For the price of only eleven fifty-six, you can buy your own personal hair dryer. Luminous, bold, beautiful. It's the beef knees. But wait, what was that? Can't afford it? Your husband's buying too much alcohol? Aw, oh, honey, don't worry. You can still get your hair to look like Mary Pickford in only five payments of two dollars and thirty-nine cents. Yup, that's right. I said it. Only five payments, two dollars and thirty-nine cents. The Ram. The Bing King crisis. After the Liberals won a minority government in the 1925 election, they were caught in a political scandal that shook the nation. Some of the Liberal politicians have been caught smuggling alcohol into the United States. Now, with the intensity of prohibition law, Prime Minister King was terrified that there would be a vote of non-confidence. So he asked Governor General Lord Bing to call an election. Bing denied the request, and for two reasons. One, there had been a federal election only a year ago. Also, Bing wanted the leader of the Conservative Party, Meehan, to be Prime Minister, because his party had won the most seats in the previous election. Meehan held a vote of non-confidence and became Prime Minister. His government didn't last long, though, for in three days, it had been defeated in the House of Commons. Now Bing had no choice but to call an election. The 1926 election showed what a clever politician King was. In his speeches, he would talk about how Bing's refusal to call the election earlier was ignoring the Canadian wishes. How could an unelected British official tell the Canadian Prime Minister what to do? The people forgetting about the scandal and listening to King's appeal, he returned to office once again, and this time with the majority government. We'll be back after this commercial. Morning, man. Voting today? Yeah, for me and... is brought to you by the Liberal Party of Canada. Photo challenge, photo challenge, photo challenge, photo challenge. Today's photo challenge is about Bing. Bing isn't Canadian, wasn't even elected, and still thinks he has more authority than the Prime Minister of Canada. This is how many people view him, as an alien. The second picture, Bing thinking that he can rule our country. But this picture clearly shows that he can't even bathe himself. So, Bing has short hair, is bad mouth, and is always trying to flap his immature wings. 
Pumbley, dee 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 dee